By now, I think you know what happened to your sandwich, but you may not know how it happened. So let me tell you, it all started with the bear. The morning air was warm and bright when the bear stepped out of his den. He stretched and sniffed. The scent of ripe berries drifted towards him and led to a wonderful discovery. After a berry feast, the bear laid out in the sunlight and listened to the buzzing of the bees, and then found a nice hiding spot to nap. And before long, he was asleep. By the time the bear opened his eyes, the buzzing had become a rumbling. The forest disappeared in the distance, and strange cliffs rose up around him. Once the rumbling stopped, the bear found himself in a new forest. It was like nothing he'd ever seen before. This forest had so many great climbing spots. The trees were still itchy here. There was good bark for scratching. There were also many interesting smells in this forest. Leafy green smells led the bear to new fun. And that's when he saw it. There it was. Your beautiful and delicious sandwich. All alone. He waited to make sure no one saw him, not even the sandwich, before he made his move. It was such a great sandwich. The, the, the bear loved it. But just as he was almost finished, he heard something behind him. He had been seen by me. The bear was so surprised that he, he ran out of the park and down the street until he spotted a, a very tall tree. And from the top of the tree, the bear could see his forest. And he knew it was time to go home. So that's what happened to your sandwich. The bear ate it. I saw it all. I tried to save your sandwich. I was able to save some crumbs for you though. The bear left them as he was running away, but I couldn't save the rest. I'm sorry I have to tell you about your sandwiches this way, but now you know. The bear ate your sandwich.